everyone. Wow, I am so glad that you could join me today. I'm very excited because I am just about to make some chocolate chip cookies. And I'd love to have you join me while I mix. So I have already started by putting my butter in my bowl. I've got some butter in my bowl. I've got my favorite broken spoon and I'm just about to make some cookies. Now, you know, cookies, they kind of come together and some of the ingredients are kind of strange. Because if I was to eat some of those ingredients and tasted them, I would not like the flavor of it. But when you put it all together, it makes a wonderful, gooey, sometimes a little crunchy, yummy treat. And I love chocolate chip cookies, so I'm, I'm about to make some. So I have my butter, and it says that I need to put some sugar, so there's some white sugar and some brown sugar, and I'll put that in my, in my bowl. And I'm gonna mix it up really, really well because it needs to be mixed up really well. But you know what? When you mix it all up, sometimes you can't even tell what's in there. It kind of looks like a gooey mess, and then it, it doesn't look like butter anymore, and it doesn't look like white sugar anymore, or brown sugar. It's just one big lump of ooey gooeyness. See? It's an ooey gooeyness. Then it says for me, I've got to follow directions because if I don't follow the directions and put these in right, then I will not have good chocolate chip cookies. So I've got them mixed. I'm gonna pop my egg in. And there you go, egg is in. Now make sure that that gets stirred up really well. So I wanna make sure that when I bite into my chocolate chip cookie, that I don't run into any egg. I don't think that would be pleasant. All right, I think I've got it all kind of mixed up now. Now what it says for me to do next is to put in some vanilla. So I've got my vanilla all measured out. There's the vanilla. I'm gonna mix that up. Then it said for me to get some hot water and put it with my baking soda. Now, wait a minute, what are all these ingredients here? Broccoli? Do you think I should put some broccoli in my chocolate chip cookies? I don't think so either. I think the broccoli is for dinner. I don't think broccoli belongs in chocolate chip cookies. Well, how about that? That looks a little bit like brown sugar. No, it looks like pepper. Does pepper belong in chocolate chip cookies? I don't think so. I don't think they would taste very good if I put pepper. And here's this big container of salt that looks a little bit like sugar, but I bet you if I stick my finger in there and taste it, it wouldn't taste anything like sugar. I think that I need to follow the directions. Now, there we've got it all mixed. And then it says for me to put my flour, and there's my flour. I'm gonna give it a nice big shake because I want it all to go in there properly. We're almost done. My oven's already ready to go. And come on, mix. <gasps> What do you think I'm missing? I've got my flour, my sugar, my butter, my vanilla, my egg. Hmm, it's missing a very important ingredient. Huh, what was I making again? Chocolate chip cookies, right? <gasps> That's right! I'm missing the chocolate chips. It says, I need about a cup of those. Oh, those sound yummy. That's about a cup of it. Oh, what if I put raisins in there? Would you be happy if you bit into a chocolate chip cookie and found raisins? Neither would I. Oh, that looks better. That looks more like chocolate chip cookie dough. Wanna have a little peek? There's your peek. Okay, I'm gonna move this over and I'm gonna put my tray down and I'm gonna load my chocolate chip cookie dough onto my tray and you're gonna just have to wait and see what it looks like later on so I don't know that you can stick around long enough to see them bake but I'm gonna put some on my tray here I'm so excited because I love chocolate chip cookies and I love to smell them baking now remember I had to follow the directions didn't I 
And I had to make sure that the, what I put in there was sugar and not salt. And I had to make sure that the broccoli didn't go in there because those were for dinner. And I had to measure everything out. You know, the Bible's a lot like that. God wants us to follow the directions. God says he, he needs for us to do that because there's a way to do things. The other thing is, is that if I didn't put chocolate chip cookies in here, or chocolate chips in there, it wouldn't be a chocolate chip cookie, would it? It would just be a cookie. Chocolate chips make it a chocolate chip cookie. You know, our verses for this month in June is about love. And if it says in the Bible that if you don't have love, you're like a noise, or you're not very useful. So like my cookies, if I didn't put the correct ingredients, I wouldn't get a cookie. Love, you have to put the right ingredients in to get love, and God's love is very special. So I hope that you have learned 1 Corinthians chapter 13, verses 4 through 7. We're only not doing only verse 4, but we're also doing all the way to verse 7. Well, that's about all I have time for. I've got to put these cookies in. And maybe I'll let you take a peek later on when they come out of the oven. All right, see you next time. Bye.